told y'all Diddy is poly okay he's polygamous now look he didn't confirm this but that's what he's giving why am I saying this well yesterday the shade room posted Diddy and this is what Diddy was saying I'm so blessed to welcome my baby girl love Sean Combs to the world mama Combs Quincy Justin Christian Chance Delilah Jesse and myself all love you so much God is the greatest okay that's what he posted at the time we didn't know that you know anything and if y'all recall last month y'all remember young Miami was posting about having another baby how she had baby fever she kept talking about baby she even said before this came out that some about her daughter she didn't know you know if her daughter was mixed or whatever she was basically saying her daughter came out looking different her daughter is beautiful young carisha her, her yeah young miami's baby girl is pretty so yeah diddy got baby on the way guys ain't that something because he's been flaunting homie he's been flaunting sis he's been he definitely been flaunting young miami taking her to parties buying her gifts extravagant gifts it's just been like a love fest honestly y'all i felt like diddy was falling in love with her and maybe that's what he wanted us to see you know because he can keep his relationship private we don't gotta know about it but yeah <laughs> diddy got a newborn baby on the way here we are and who is this the mother of diddy's new bundle of joy reportedly revealed as 28 year old dana tran and on here you can see tmz posted diddy shocked the world when he revealed he has recently welcomed a new baby girl into the world and now we've learned more about the baby's mother as you can see she is asian how do y'all feel about this now some think that this is a slap in the face of the black community um I, it, look diddy can date who he want but i'm starting to feel offended and i don't want to feel offended i don't want to feel that but I, let me tell you why I feel like too many powerful black men are basically not they, it just feels like they 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 say to us black women that we're not good enough to carry their seed to be the heirs of all of their wealth it feels like a slap in the face and i don't want it to feel like that because i ain't the type of person to sit back and hate on the next woman i just got to tell you how i feel i feel like when it comes to kanye when it comes to diddy it, just all of them as it seems like Especially the more wealth they obtain, they go out and they further go out and away from the black community. Here you see DJ Academics pissing off the black community because he only really posts when it comes towards black women. You know what? DJ Academics, he is always and has always been when it came to Cardi and Nicki Minaj. Honey, DJ Academics, he made it clear who he stood with. He made it clear who he represented, whose side he was on. He was on Cardi B's side. And it, and it made me feel some type of way that he never stood for what was right. Because he didn't like Nicki. He didn't even care if Nicki was right about whatever point about the rap. And he's supposed to be like a blogger of the rapper. He's not keeping it real even when it comes to writing raps. He'd rather be on the other side. And that's what I'm saying. They have no loyalty to black people. And they black they black you know they're they're black they're you know it's it's just trying to jump on the other side and on the bandwagon all the time but he posted to young miami out of the blue misdirected anger brother love wouldn't approve of this behavior i ain't the one that had a side baby on y'all relax and young miami miami responds and says academics my name ain't D, so keep it out your mouth. You the type of nigga my uncle doing like li doing life sentences for, and you can see is is blacked out. The shade room got it all blacked out, okay? And so here is what DJ Academics responded and said: Young Miami mad at me for pointing out the obvious. You said you ain't that nigga go together real bad. That nigga had another baby with another woman. You said the side chick. Don't get mad now. At least you get hella gifts. Live your life, queen. Also, you tell us your business. LOL, of course we gonna comment. And this is what I hate about this dude. Why do the men that's supposed to, that want to be the head, that wants, they don't, they don't want to be our head no more. They used to demand that as women we submit, right? And this is the reason they claim they go over to, the, to another race. Because they say black women don't submit. Black women argue. But this is what I'm starting to hate. You black nigga and it's in you to be able to handle everything we come with because you black and i think that they forget that 
And when they get a little money in their pockets, a little reputation, these chicks, they wouldn't even look their way had they not had what they have. They don't even, and these black men, they don't even care, y'all. They just chase the woman that they always wanted that would never give them the time of day when they was broke. Because in reality, without DJ Academics' power and his clout that he got, his little shine he got, do you think these other races would really look his way? You think he'd be able to bag the women he bagging? The name he built for himself? No, he wouldn't. Because he ain't nothing to really to look at. No. So to me, you you attacking young Miami. And young Miami, she didn't say anything. People was coming at her. We see out here all that Diddy is, all the attention Diddy showing young Miami. Listen, even me myself feel like Diddy fell in love with young Miami. I feel like Diddy can't just use a young Miami because she's not she's not just you know flat and nothing young Miami's substantial and she's deep she's she's not just a fling type of chick she not she's coming with something something that money can buy something that Tran and, and and Daphne Joy can't give and if y'all don't know who Daphne Joy is that's his other sister wife and if you I'm sorry that that's what I think Diddy is on I really think Diddy is pol- polygamous <laughs> okay at this point I do but DJ Academics instead of him confronting he don't confront Tran he don't confront he don't say nothing disrespectful or at Daphne he don't come at them even though Daphne was in the media also going you know getting in her feelings over young miami when young miami was getting most of the attention daphne was reacting dj academics had nothing to say why because he is intimidated by the other race i really believe that i really believe that they threaten they have more respect because it's more fear for the other race so they feel inferior to them where us black women they they don't like us anyway there's no fear they don't like us, they don't respect us, and they don't think we worth as much as a trend, as much as a Daphne Joy. But you know what? Young Miami, not that one. She's not that one where you can just side piece her only. And what I like about her is that Young Miami made it clear when she had Diddy on her show, Carisha Please, her first guest was Diddy. She Diddy was like, What are we, Young Miami? What are we, Carisha? And she just, she was like, <laughs> we dating. <laughs> and I love that because even if she has feelings for him, even if she might be digging him, he's, look, he don't, he working overtime. She still know her worth. She still knows, knows her value. She still knows where she's at. She's in reality and she's not side swept. Okay. She's not side swept by anyone. And I like that. She has maintained that they're dating and I'm feeling that. Because if she's going to do it, do it right. And I think she's so far doing it right as far as what right can do. Y'all, check the shade, right? And shout out to the neighborhood talk. I don't know if Trin did this before or after the whole pregnancy came and it got out. And Diddy put out the preg- the baby mama. But this is her right here, right? This is Trin. This is Diddy's newest baby mom. She is actually sitting. She's on a doing a song with a friend or whatever. She's mimicking young miami song in in uh, jt's song that's what she's doing right now so she definitely was throwing shade that's definitely jealousy you a sister wife two girls chill out fall back and calm down okay thirsty drink some water you're thirsty drink it because you just as much as sister wife as daphne joy young miami and, and the other chicks we done posted about. There's a new, and, and Diddy got a new girl he's been posting up with a, an IG model. Her name is Shanti or something like something to that effect. Y'all, look, we talking about Diddy though. If I'm gonna be in a polygamous relationship, it's gonna be with the Diddy. It, it, I'd rather it be with the Diddy than a nature boy. You know what I'm saying? Let me know what y'all think in the comments below, y'all. Stay tuned because I'm sure there's gonna be more to come. Peace.